Sometimes doctors can tell before a baby is born that there are health problems, but the solution to those problems might require a second opinion. Today in Health Watch, Shelly Abotot tells us why the right diagnosis and doctor make a world of difference. What happens when your baby is in danger before it's even born? The police family couldn't believe their luck. I'll never forget, we were so thrilled to find out we were having a little girl. We had a little boy at home and we were hoping for a little girl. But elation turned to fear after one ultrasound, a lesion on baby Evelyn's left lung. You can see and immediately there's a difference here. And this is the mass, it's pretty large. It's terrifying and you know, you very much take for granted that your child's gonna be healthy. Their first doctor said Evelyn would be rushed into surgery as soon as she was born and would have a large incision down her back. Something didn't feel right, so Shalena went online and found Dr. Cass. This is Big Brother. Dr. Cass leads a team of fetal surgery specialists. A comprehensive fetal treatment program is a collaboration of lots of different specialists, specialists that come to the table. There's the obstetricians and the maternal fetal medicine doctors. A fetal MRI gave doctors a better diagnosis and plan. Evelyn had a specific type of lung malformation we commonly call extra low bar pulmonary sequestration. The police brought baby Evelyn home right away and three months later went back for surgeons to remove her lesion without any large incision. She's experienced no problems, no side effects. Shalena urges other parents not to automatically accept an initial diagnosis. We were so grateful to find someone who made us feel so comfortable. And baby Evelyn's grateful too. There are only about 20 fetal treatment centers in the United States. Go to our website for more information. Now, Dr. Cass says it's important to seek out an experienced team to make sure your baby is getting the most successful outcome. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 5 News.